You might describe it as immersive theatre, the sort of thing usually aimed at more mature theatre goer. But this sellout show, Primo, is aimed at four year olds. We've got a work from Germany where the audience sit around a swimming pool and observe the performance through see through portholes. And two, um, I suppose you'd call them dancers, are in the water um, creating this very atmospheric, meditative work. I just turned 13 and I was having dinner with my parents at the kitchen table when a punch landed on my right cheek. Nor does the work shy away from hard-hitting subjects like bullying or abuse. This show, Evil, was selected by young people in the Craig Miller area of Edinburgh, which is why its Danish star was determined to get here, despite a clash with the Cannes Film Festival, where his latest film won the top prize. Well, we agreed that I should come, and I, I, I am, I'm a man of my word. So, um, but the festival was really, really nice and sort of changed my, my uh, schedule here so that I could actually attend the award ceremony on, on Sunday in Cannes. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to be there. I'm doing three shows today. I've never done three in a, um, ever, not, in, not even in, in, in Danish. So it's really, it's going to be interesting to see if I get through it. For many Scottish companies, the festival has offered an important platform for children's theatre. It's because it doesn't dumb down to kids, it doesn't make it, you know, kiddie and, you know, um, silly. There's a real sophistication and that all the adults in the theatre can enjoy the work just as much as the children. And with shows from nine countries across nine days, there's something for everyone, whatever your age, as long as you're prepared to take the plunge and try something new. Polly McLean reporting Scotland, Edinburgh.